All right, so I need to say this, even though I have like 10 people on my Facebook page that are friends, and I doubt too many people will ever even see this video clip, but there's something really bothers me about Vice President Joe Biden's pick for his running mate, um, Kamala Harris, but it has nothing to do with her. What bothers me the most is that a month, maybe two months ago, President or Vice President Biden said that he would pick a woman of color. He even promised he would pick a woman of color. And this is what bothers me about that statement. He never once said, I never heard him say, he was going to pick the best candidate for the job, the best person for the job. He said he would pick a woman of color for the job. What if the best person to run with Vice President Biden was a woman but not of color? What if it was a man of color? What if it was an actual white male? I mean, it just seems ridiculous that he would limit a huge population of potential candidates to run with him just so he could pick a woman of color. And that just really bothers me. It seems like he was, well, he was just determined to do that. And maybe Kem Kamala Harris is the best candidate for the job. I don't know. Um, I don't care. It, what bothers me is that he eliminated a huge population of people that could have run, that could have been more qualified, but that didn't, it, qualification wasn't the issue for him. It was the fact that she had to be or the person had to be female and um, person of color. I have nothing against Kamala Harris. Don't agree with her policies, but I have nothing against her. Um, I don't have any problem with a woman being a running mate. I have no problem with a person of color being a, room, a running mate, if they're the best person for the job and most qualified for the job. So that just, I don't get it. And nobody seems to be talking about that, that he didn't care about getting the best candidate for the job he wanted a woman of color in that position. And that just bothers me a lot. That's my two cents worth. Thanks for listening.